Hi, today I wanted to talk about creating new tabs with custom URLs. So Chrome lets you create uh, a custom home page so that instead of Google popping up when you open up the browser, it'll go to, let's say, New York Times or ESPN or any other web page that you want it to go to. So that's essentially just setting this uh, home button up here to go to wherever you want. And we can do that together right now. So uh, I already have that here. I typed it in earlier and I just confirmed it. So now if I hit the home button, it'll bring me to the New York Times. And anytime I push that button, it'll do that. Pretty straightforward and self-explanatory. Now, if I want to create a new tab, it'll always go to uh, google.com and kind of go to the traditional Google search engine. And there's no straightforward way to kind of change that in the settings there. Luckily, uh, there's a uh, Chrome extension for that. So let's take a look at that together. All right, let's copy this and I'll put this in the description so you can just copy and paste it and download it for yourself. It is a free extension, which is pretty fantastic. So what we'll do, it's already added to Chrome. Uh, I did this uh, prior uh, to kind of test it out to make sure it works the way it's supposed to. So I'm just going to go ahead and enable it here. All right, once it's enabled, you're going to see it pop up on the side here. And what you'll do is click on it and you'll go to options. All right. And then from the options, you can put any URL you want in here. Uh, for me, I want it to be New York Times. But you have to make sure uh, that it has the HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash on it. So you can't just write nytimes.com because it won't work. It'll crash. So make sure to do HTTPS first or some websites that don't have uh, SSL. Just you can try it with HTTP without the S. All right, uh, make sure it's enabled and we'll hit save. All right, so now anytime I hit the plus for a new tab, it'll always bring me to my default uh, kind of a homepage, the New York Times. Uh, I prefer uh, it this way because let's say if I'm doing a lot of uh, research or something, I don't want to uh, you know search through Google. I wanna search uh, through New York Times for you know specific articles uh, related to journal journalism. Uh, some people want things like, uh, maybe Bloomberg or Mac Rumors or just whatever website you prefer to see as your kind of landing page. So that's pretty much it. Just wanted to share that quick tip with everyone. Thank you for watching and we hope to see you next time.